what is up intergalactic friends welcome back here to another infinite galaxy content i'm sure you guys are excited to see what's next into the video right so today we are the princep and being the princep um i have some abilities in here i have the ability to give federation pack so today we're gonna honor some of those players who have contributed to our success this video is not just to share what's going on in my account, what's going on in our server. It's also just for me to capture these wonderful moments as well for my allies and for my members. Guys, I've been playing this game for a while now and if you're watching this and you're new, I'm telling you that this game is really fun and I enjoy it. Um, I wouldn't be here if I'm not enjoying it. Really, the best thing about this is that we've found great allies and, um, you know, having the good leadership um, diplomacy was perfect for this. When I first started into the game, I remember not knowing anything. And um, this guy from GMF or all, you know, before he was named HHH, um, well, the Alliance name, uh, helped me out in my main channel stream and walked me through how to understand the game. And now I learn a lot. Um, it's just such a good partnership so far. So today we're gonna be giving out Federation pack. In my previous video, I talked about the Federation officer and I talked about how you can you know, get basically title. You have to click the picture and you can request. What I didn't realize at that time is that only the Alliance that are within the union can only request application. So if you're not in union, you cannot do it. You can either type and appoint somebody and find the name, but if they're not in union, keep that in mind, you cannot apply. So if your alliance is, let's say your alliance C, you're not with union with alliance A, they need to drop alliance B, bring you in. Sorry, I guess your alliance D. Wow, my logic, right? So if alliance A, B, C are in union and alliance D is not in union um, and you are in alliance D, you have to get into union before you can get, you know, um, officer title. So just keep that in mind. Union is the key. All right. So what you can do is you can drop the tags, drop the unions and switch it out every two, three days or something. You guys, whatever um, deals you guys make for your server. So Federation pack. I'm going to show you guys how to give out in, in this video. I'm going to be giving out chest and we're going to also talk about leadership style. Um, I'll talk about how my leadership is and what's my approach and style. And maybe you guys can learn from it, implement it. And maybe you guys can share to me um, how is the leadership in your nebula? Do you like it or not? Let me know in the comment section below. What is the leadership type and are you guys still in war or is it on peace? Let us know. Okay uh so here in the gold chest so we had some mishap i you know i placed somebody as a spokes you know uh cabinet spokesman and being a cabinet spokesman they can also give chess so be careful make sure you trust the person who's going to be the cabinet spokesman i assigned somebody to be the cabinet spokesman but you know the player gave out chess too early not following the instructions that I have given. So we have to make some adjustments today. Um, so keep that in mind, okay? So I'm gonna be giving up my first chest. Like I said, I, this, this person helped me out throughout into the game and um, really the relationship between TIK and GMF really it was because of this person. So for me, I'm gonna be giving out this chest uh, to Nemesis, but I know he recently changed his name so i'm gonna be giving out to nem bear <laughs> i don't know why it's nem bear but we're gonna give it out to nem bear giving him a legendary uh gift so it's gonna be the gold heart defender pack i got three out of five he's gonna get one all right here we go we have sent it to him um, I wish it would give us a note in here on how, uh, you know, if so, who's, who's receiving the gift would be really cool. So the next ones that we're going to give, I was going to give one to Malone, actually. But since we had some issue, um, we might have to do that next time. 
since, uh, like I said, somebody just gave out extra chess that wasn't planned. Very unfortunate. But I have to reward the players in our alliance that contributed a lot. Um, so definitely um, one player that I want to recognize is sending it to Rhapsody and also China Kerno. Um, how do I spell Rhapsody? Wait, did I spell that right? All right. So um, we're going to give one to Rhapsody Fire um, because they really did a great job for our what is that called for our um secret signal and they definitely fully deserve that um where'd it go so s she's lost a lot of power fighting another one that i want to give credit is lucy um she definitely deserve it or he does deserve it but um it was already given to him so i don't have to worry about that then another one is going to go for china kerno and we're going to send it here china kerno hopefully i spelled that right china kerno gets one so we have now assigned all the legendary packs in here and now we're going to go for silver chest in here so we're going to send to first of all Keroro. he had really helped us out a lot um Keroro tik in here sending one to him and then captain zap which is another person who helped us out captain zap Cap captain zap i think is that how you spell it so this is how you do things oh can't find him captain zap oh i spelled it i, I spelled captain wrong captain zap so japanese player wait how can i not find Oh, am I not spelling this correctly, guys? Help me out. <laughs> I'm struggling. Don't watch the don't watch the video if I'm spelling it wrong. Um, let's go find him here. Captain Zach. Yeah. I had it right. But that's weird. Oh, S A Q. S A Q. That's what it means. Okay. So we're gonna give one to him. We're gonna paste that search. He gets one for helping us. Um, SSS. Um, we got to reward our um, R4 as well. So Pippo. Pippo, Pippo. Right here. With uh, level 26. He is R4. I need to fix that. All right. And Hamster. The animal Hamster. Hamster. Yes. Wow. Oh, my goodness. So many accounts. Busted, buddy. <laughs> Where's the one in TIK? Uh, where did he go? Um, I don't know where his main account is. So we got to make sure that we give it to the right uh, players. So I have to look. Look for his uh, picture because I cannot find. I don't know where he went. He might not be here anymore. Yeah, I I really have no clue where his main account is because I don't think this is his main account either. That's really weird. He must have changed name, so we have to skip him for now. That is unfortunate, really, because I want to get this done. People shouldn't be changing their names. So next would be Eric B because Eric B was continuously burning our enemies throughout. So he gets one. We give one to Abbott for uh, actively trying to learn the game as well. Um, yep, Abbott. We will give one to oh, Kumataro got it already. Uh, we will give one to Ernest Twiner. Ernest Twiner. We're going to give one to him. How can I not spell these guys' names right? They are my members. <laughs> um, so my leadership. Let's talk about my leadership in here. My leadership is basically um, I want everybody to feel like this is their own alliance. This is not mine. Um, I serve them. I serve everybody in the alliance. They are the boss. I am the slave, even though I make some decisions. But at the end of the day, 
I'm just uh, I'm just the uh, slave in here. Uh, probably slave is not the right word to use, but you know I work for them. I need to make them happy, so you know we can all uh, succeed into the game. So, um, you know, what type of leadership are you guys looking? So for me, um, I know if I'm a member, I want to be able to be involved. I want the leaders to you know talk to me, get to know me. So some of the things that I do is really trying to um, get to know. You know, get to know the players. That's the most important thing uh, to me. Like, I try to get to know them. Like, hey, where are you from? What are you doing? Like, you know, um, what you what what kind of stuff you like? And try to get them involved in getting to Discord. So, we're giving a lot to Mario there. Um, so we'll have little leftovers. We got two leftover because I couldn't find hamster, or um, I couldn't ha find am hamster and uh, pip. Uh, what is that called? Um hamster and uh ne never mind i just couldn't find hamster the other one i still haven't decided who to, who to give it to but okay so let's make sure we don't give double so ellen Yale has it already and barca travis so now we're going for bronze so we have to skip ellen Yale and barca so we're gonna give to devil devil gets one so um, Iron Heights. So another thing in TIK is that everything is decision made, you know, by R four consen you know, uh, consensus. So I don't make the decision by myself. Um, well, sometimes I do. I make the big calls, but most of the time I would say, "Hey, you know, you guys are the R four. Um, what um, decision should we do? I need your opinion because in this way, you know, we get." everybody like involved and gonna be enjoying the game that way rather than just me making all the decisions in here um i cannot spell johnny's name which is kind of sad again um johnny be good right here so he's getting a pack um this is just you know you know kind of like more like gameplay sorry guys if it's not too exciting here we go by the way if you guys don't know what you can get here's the gold uh, you can get some uh, gold uh, federation credits and you know here we go silver pack and bronze of course the gold is going to be the best and um who is next captain autumn captain o tim one for you one for high buy Oh boy. Let's see if we search high. If his name is going to pop out. Nope. What is wrong, man? So, tip, right? Make sure that you go find the players in here. So, there we go. Um, tedious work, but this is part of being in the leadership role. So, you need to appreciate, you know, your leaders as well. It's not a it's not an easy thing uranus <laughs> okay um wait oh oh see see here's a trick so, oh there's another person named uranus that's why she didn't have that name um okay that's actually interesting uranus <laughs> oh funny name where is it where is uranus <laughs> oh man i bet if bex is watching oh wow she looks so pretty here in this new picture damn she's hot she says hi english you're oh your anus tian wang shi is that what it is tian wang shi so her name in in in, in... oh man i don't know um maybe that's her real name i, I don't know Federation pack sending one to Uranus. Sent. Um, Mr. Moon is next. Mr. Moon, he plays with us in uh, in the other game that I play. So now I gotta go search. This is I, I wanna quit. I don't wanna do this anymore. 
Why is everybody's name so difficult? This is too much work for me. Mr. Moon. Okay, so next is Krilling. I think I already saw Krilling. Um, just go here. I saw Krilling right here. Send one to him. Um, I don't need for me. I'm not getting one for me. God knows. I already we Barka already got it. Oh, kill shot. Kill shot. Kill shot gets one. I think there's a space. Kill shot. Nope. My goodness. God dang it. So annoying. I gotta go look for these guys' names. Oh, you know how annoying that is, guys? Um Oh, because he's got some weird ass name. All right. Kill shot. Um So Bark already got it. God knows is next. God knows. God knows right here. All right, next is Surreal. We still got seven. Surreal. Bay, Bay for helping us. Oh, man. There we go, Bay. Bay. Oh, actually, yeah, she's still here with us. There we go. And Audison. Kisa Audison. Oh man. What about Ryu? Let's we'll skip Audison for now. Ryu. Guys, the names is killing me. Oh my goodness. Okay, I gotta go find uh please when you guys are creating an account, have an easy name. Have an easy name because it's killing your leaders like me. Like I gotta go look for everybody's name. Odin. Oh, it's Audinson. Oh, I always call him Audison. I'm a bad leader. <laughs> I don't read it properly. It's Audinson. Oh man. What about Ryu? Ryu. Where is this guy? Oh man, I feel so bad. Um Ryu, Ryu, so we'll go here, we'll give one to Ryu, and Sea Dog and Cap 939, Sea Dog, he's Okay. C dog. I think it's one word. Yep, C dog, one word. Cap 939. Is it the last one? Okay. Cap 939. Send one. Okay, so one more remaining. Um I don't remember who I am missing. Oh, Cat BK. Cat, Cat BK. There we go. So we finalize in here. We still got two into the silver defender pack. Got to figure out, you know, Hamster's, you know, new name if he changed it. But I'm trying to reach out to him first. And then I don't know who else to give the next one in here because everything kind of got screwed up. Um, on who we're going to give. So we'll decide on the next chest in here. But this is pretty much it. And um, basically my leadership, when I get people involved in you know, some of the members, if you're watching, you'll probably realize this how I do. I mentioned to you guys before when you guys start to join us and I said, this is your alliance, not mine. You're going to put work for it. Um, you know, everybody's got to contribute. You know, we, we, we work here as a family. You know, I may be the, you know, the leader. I'm just, you know, for show, make maybe tougher decisions and push people to do things that are, you know, people don't want to do things. But at the end of the day, TIK, 
is not mine. TIK is yours. And TIK is a collective group of people working together to succeed. You can be in rank one, rank two. It doesn't matter. Rank doesn't matter in TIK. Right? It only gives you a little bit of privileges on what you can do in the game. But anybody in TIK can lead. And that's what we have seen so far in the previous situations that we you know encountered here in the alliance i i love the group of people that we have and especially the new players that who have joined us it's wonderful so um yeah i'm just super happy to be part of this group uh, my leadership is very chill as long as you're active you play yeah we have fun i i don't um uh, don't hide things from the members um i tell them straight up what's going on because i i want to build that bridge that trust and for the leaders you know take it easy on your members um you know make sure you communicate get to know them don't just treat them as a player treat them as a person get to know them uh, you know in life and become friends with your members and that's one good way to keep that bonding and um you know continue to play the game throughout the history of your gaming but maybe in the future, I'll, I'll do more in detail guide on how I lead and how you should lead and maybe what type of uh, constructive uh, feedback that we can do to uh, create a basic information guide on leading an alliance to become like a perfect. Because there's no perfect leader. You know, there's no perfect leader. There's always going to be a lot of mistakes, but you got to learn from their mistakes. And I'll talk about it. Uh, maybe I'll share some of my secrets. I don't know yet. I don't know if I'm ready to share my secrets yet. But I've learned a lot because I've led, you know, alliances before in different games and I've failed so many times. And this time I put everything that I've learned and try to make it successful. But besides that, guys, I'll see you guys again next time, Intergalactic Friends. Don't forget, if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to do so. Click that subscribe button and press that like for analytics.